Are you loving it? Yeah, you know I'm loving it. Loving it. Are you loving it? Yeah, you know I'm loving it. So, loving it. So, so, so it. loving it, you can't get enough of it. Then put the hand up high, right where the other is. Are you loving it? Yeah, you know I'm loving it. Are you loving it? Yeah, you know you loving it. So if you're loving it, you can't get enough of it. Then put the hand up high, right where the other is. Are you loving it? Yeah, you know I'm loving it. Are you loving it? Yeah, you know you're loving it. And if you're loving it, you can't get enough of it. Hello guys, this is that snazzy iPhone guy here with you today, and we're going to be taking a look at a fun little game called Hydro Tilt. Now you're going, uh, Hydro Tilt, that sounds familiar. Yeah, it's because Abgrew Andrew has already done a review on it. Uh, well, the reason I'm coming at you with a review is because I bought it. I mean, for right now, uh, it is three or two ninety nine for a limited time. That's a good price for this game. I mean. $5 is a little extreme, kind of like Edge. I mean, it's a good game when you buy it, but a little bit hard to drop when you get it. So it's $2.99, great deal now, so get it while you can. It's called Hydro Tilt, okay? And uh, you can get it in the App Store for $2.99 for a limited time. The developer is, uh, or the publisher is Publisher X, and the dev is uh, Code Glue. So, I mean, check both those guys out. Um, this is a very decent game, and uh, I like it a lot. The soundtrack is actually really, really good. That's kind of what bugged me in App Guru's video, but I've turned out to really like it, so I don't know if that's just me being weird, but it's kind of like funky at the same time. See? It's kind of snazzy. I like it. Okay, so start game. I'm on level 5, and <laughs> I haven't gone very far. We're going to chill all the way back down on level 1. Oops. Okay, so there's, you can view your best times and stuff like that, uh, and your crystal. Oh no, I didn't want to do level 5. Darn it. Okay, um, I might have to exit out because, okay, so this is accelerometer based, and yeah, I'm going to have to exit out. Uh, sorry guys. Okay. So Hydro Tilt, start game. Level 1, please. Play. Anyway, so it's a pretty decent game for $2.99. What you are is you're a little speck of water. And it's going to guide me through the tutorial again, I think. Yeah. Okay, so it's Hydro Tilt. And uh, the objective is to the game is to get to the portal at the end. Alright? While being ice. You start as a water droplet. And there's other things that you can achieve. There is one of these crystals hidden in every level. They give you an added bonus to the game, and they're necessary to beat it. Now this part is your ice. That then turns you into ice. Ice makes it very sensitive and almost easy to fall off the side of the map. That's one thing I don't particularly like. The sensitives or the controls are extremely sensitive. Anyway, so there we go. Level 1 completed. My best time was 18 seconds. I found the crystal, and that time was 30 seconds, alright? So then uh, you go on to the next level. has a very smooth, sleek interface. There's different obstacles that arrive. Um, right here, it goes, okay, so we have to get to the ice the other way. That's a... Um, that doesn't look like I can go through there. See, if I go through there, I'm water, so I fall through the hole. You die, alright? Now the most frustrating thing about this game is if you fall, uh, you don't get reset. It's just game over, try again. So that's kind of difficult to do. Okay, so now we're the ice cube. Oh, uh, no, shoot. Anyway, so we're going to go through this water slide and get the secret crystal right there. Then we're going to slide back through the water slide. See, when you run into a water slide when you're ice, you turn back into water. But when you're ice, you can go over these, whereas you can't with water. Alright, so then you go to your goal, there you go, level complete in 33 seconds. So, I mean, it's a very fun game. Um, I Actually, I would buy this for $4.99, as ridiculous as that sounds. Um, this is a very, very decent game. I like it more than SimCity, dare I say I like it more than Rolando. Um, it's a very fun game. Um, very well designed, the interface is very slick, and... Uh, the only suggestion I would make to the developer is to turn the tip screens off. I, I, you can't do that. 
and uh, so it does all this every time. So if you're trying to get a new score and you already know what to do, it tells you all over again. It's a pain in the butt. So these electric things make things move. You can only do that when you're water because only current passes through water. You have to stay on this platform while you're moving, which is actually kind of tricky. You go off. There you go. Oh, I started making that one move. Okay. So then I wait for the platform to come back. And you know, it's just... Oh. It's just a fun little game. I mean, it's very, very decent. It's called Hydro Tilt. For a limited time, I believe, it's $2.99 in the app store. Great price for that. Uh, $4.99, I don't know. You just kind of have to decide. It may be a hit or miss for you. Uh, it was definitely a hit for me. So at $2.99, I'd say it's a definite buy. Uh, for more than that, I'm not sure. But uh, anyway, so uh, this is that snazzy iPhone guy. And uh, I'm glad you joined me on this video review of Hydro Tilt. Oh, whoa. oh yeah. <laughs> and so, thank you all so much for watching. As always, stay snazzy.